Welcome to Tinkernut.com's video cast. In this video, we'll learn how to make a bootable flash drive. And this, all this is, is a flash drive that you can use to boot your computer. And what you'll need is a new Ubuntu image and a one gig or more flash drive. And the first step, of course, would be to download the Ubuntu ISO image. And all you can do is search for Ubuntu and uh, the first thing that comes up should be the main Ubuntu web page. And you can just download it from there. Um, and if this step seems familiar, that's because a couple of tutorials ago um, we had to do the exact same thing. So if you followed along with that tutorial, you may already have this image downloaded. And if so, it's fine to just use that. If not, just go ahead and follow these quick steps and get it downloaded. And it's a pretty large file, so um, it may take a little while. And what you want to do is load Ubuntu um, either by burning it to a CD and booting to that CD or by loading it in VMware as I showed you how to do a couple of tutorials ago. Um, but the main thing you want to do is have Ubuntu loaded and also make sure it has an internet connection. And then the next step we would want to do is format the USB drive. Um, so to do this open up a terminal and we're going to be using the terminal and for explanations on how to do this you can go to pendrivelinux.com but uh, you want to type in a bunch of different commands and that's where you can find explanations of these. But basically what you want to do is type in fdisk and find your USB drive which is probably SDA or maybe SDB but whatever it is uh, type in U-mount and then uh, just follow the instructions here. The next thing you'll want to do is extract the Ubuntu OS files from the ISO image that we downloaded. And you can do this by going to the pendrivelinux.com URL that you see here and downloading this automated e extractor. Um, and then just save it to your desktop and also on your desktop uh, just create a folder called Linux uh, so that we can put all these files and then just extract the files to this folder that we just created and if you run into an error during extraction that's fine 
um, because I did and uh, and the main thing you want is all these files listed here as long as you have those you'll be fine um, and then the next thing you'll want to do is find the Ubuntu image that you downloaded and copy that to this folder and then once you've done that just run the fixu.bat file and follow the instructions on the screen and what it will do is automatically extract all the necessary files to run Ubuntu on the flash drive and there's a lot of them as you can see here so step number five would be to copy these files to the flash drive so make sure your flash drive is plugged in and just open it up and go back to the Ubuntu folder select all uh, copy them and then just paste them to your flash drive and it's almost 700 megabytes worth of files so it, it'll probably take a while and uh, then once you have all of them copied the next thing you'll want to do is reboot your computer into BIOS and depending on your your computer you can do this either by hitting the delete key or F2 key whenever you're starting and then you just want to check your boot menu and make sure that USB is set to the top and then just save your BIOS settings and reboot and you should be in Ubuntu. Special thanks to pendrivelinux.com for more go to tinkernut.com.